Good morning, everybody. <sighs> I really try not to get warped into these little Facebook disputes and stuff of the such. But it's just driving me crazy how women are upset that women march for their rights. I just think that's insane. Um, do you think, Granny, do you think there's anything wrong with women marching for women's rights? No, not, I didn't know. And they've been doing it, haven't they? They've been doing it, right? That's what I said. But apparently... They say no now? Apparently, that's what a lot of women are telling them not to do it. To just sit down and be quiet and not march for their rights. They're, they're doing, wrecking their kids. That's right. They're wrecking their kids. So, this is not just a young person's point of view. This is not just somebody that's uneducated and hasn't, you know, been through things in her life. My 84 year old granny is saying the same exact thing. If you think that it is not right for women to go out there and march and, <clears throat> and to exercise their right to march, if you think that's a wrong thing, then I just really feel like your priorities are messed up because what example is that setting for your children that they cannot exercise their rights without being shamed or put down for exercising these rights that were given to us and the reason they're exercising the rights, that's, I mean, that, that is the exact reason because of you people who think that it is just so absurd that these whiny little brats are going to march. No, they're not whiny brats. They're not. Every single woman I know that went and marched was a well-educated businesswoman. Not a self-entitled, sits on her rear end all day brat. That's not, that. none of the women I personally know that went and marched are like that. And I know several women that went and marched. So I just feel like people are kind of missing the mark of the march. This was not one march in Washington, D.C. This was a worldwide march. This turned out three million plus all over the world, women and men standing up for women's rights not just in America, but all over the world. And if that's not a beautiful, wonderful thing, I don't know what is. And for you to sit there behind a keyboard and be a little keyboard warrior and just say, hey, you know, you should really just sit down and shut up. Well, yeah, I bet you would love that. I bet you would love for women to sit down and shut up. And it's sad to me that a woman would say that to another woman to sit down and shut up and not stand up for what you believe in. Maybe none of these issues apply to you and that's wonderful and that's great and you should feel blessed that none of these issues apply to you. But do not attack other women who are standing up for these rights. Do not attack them. That is unfair and unjust. That's my final thought. Have a nice day.